just ended a full day of work. <sighs> Was up early this morning, got in the office early. Now it's time to go on the tee, and after the tee, then I'm going to the gym. So let's get to it, let's go! In my suitcase, I'm on a plane. It's not a suitcase, it's more of a briefcase. I be on business. And my new place isn't a duplex, more of an Eastgate. I be gone tripping. Kiss the kids and kick the dog and fix the dinner, fix the faucet, wash the dish and wish for rain. And when it pours, make sure in the midst of all, you don't forget to call me to come back. Pardon me on that. I was too young. You was young too, but uh, I was too young. What you want me to say? I'm a Debbie dad. All the sex we had was my fault. The checks she had weren't enough to get by. It's my fault. I bought. A new suitcase, I be going tripping, only briefly, probably wrong decision, but I can do it later if he got game, oh now he tripping, got his own case, he dipping, run like your pops, Junior. Out of state feels great, but it's good to be home, looking at the crib through the window, sometimes the littlest things in life don't seem so big till you're grown, take it for granted, cement footsteps, smoke rings rotate with the planets, and the planets spin it off for the market crash, oh shit, red alert, panic, somehow the fuel in the left wing lead, then we all went down. My seatbelt be tight enough to keep me wired up with a plane sprout off in the clouds was lost in the dust. Worst part about this commute to and fro work is walking. I have to walk all the way to the T out of work. I have to walk to the T in the morning. I have to walk to work and then same thing on the way back. A lot of walking. I want to get to my car. Good cardio though. Like I said, I don't know, many of you guys don't know me, but um, I do have an office job, a J-O-B. Trying to get out of it right now. Have some few things. Hopefully that this blog can help uh, maybe uh, help build one of my businesses that I have, uh, the My Warrior Lifestyle Warrior Athlete Program, um, helping athletes become from just good athletes to elite athletes, um, helping them with mindset, um, teaching them the importance of practice, and then obviously helping them with their strength. Probably the three most important things, and I'm crossing the street right now while filming. Probably the three most important things with any athlete. Um, is mindset, practice, and strength. So what I'm doing right now is actually gonna work on my strength, myself, headed to the gym, and I will see you guys after that. Peace. Finally home. I wish there was just a way that I could. Perfect. Let's go. So first off, I'm so mad I have to work out at night. I hate working out at the night. It's just terrible. i has been thinking about it all day long. And the gym's probably gonna be packed. Look at all the cars. It's gonna be packed. I'm gonna get nothing done. All I need is a squat rack. Today's leg and shoulder day. Usually I've been working on the back squat, but I'm gonna be doing some front squats today. So let's get into it. Oh. Feels good, you guys can't even see me. Feels good, so packed. All I wanted to do was go in there and get squats in. Today I was gonna do, today I did front squats. I'm terrible 
terrible at squats. That's the first thing. Um, I really never squatted in high school, in, in college. So uh, I'm, a brand, I'm a beginner with squats. So I'm learning as much as I can with the squats, trying to get my technique down. It's going to take some time, but that's what we did today. Today was front squats. Um, like I said, I was doing, I've been doing back squats the past couple of weeks. I've been going good, but um, decided to change it up, do some front squats. Different motion. Um, you know, the front squat, um, you know, just hits some different muscles that the back, back squat doesn't hit. Um, so we did front squat with lateral raises, which is this with the shoulders. And after that, we did um, a hamstring curls with, um, with quad extensions with, um, with after that, my arm is killing me. Um, after that, we did um, lunges and we did um, lunges and a shoulder press. Arnold Schwarzenegger. The Schwarzenegger name's Arnold. Uh, the way that Arnold, uh, I saw, I don't know, he said that to do them this way, close it out, um, gets a little bit more muscle. Um, also heard that those are a little bit safer as well. Um, just with the rotator cuff, when you bring them in like this, it's just a movement the rotator cuff likes a lot better. It gets to close out and, um, you know, you just get, you don't put as much strain on that rotator cuff. Um, for all the pitchers out there, look into that. Um, and then finished up, as always, with the abdominals. So, yeah, that's it. Once again, the night workouts are the worst because it's way too packed in there. There's way too many people in there. I couldn't even get into the squat rack. So stupid. Whatever. There is one good thing about working out at night, and that is I'm beat now. So now I can go home and I can just chill and get a good night's sleep because I'm beat. And I know my legs aren't gonna be feeling that hot in the morning. Um, and that's pretty much it. So. You kind of ran through my day today um, at night. And, you know, this was a longer night. I went to work early, so I was lucky. So it's not always like this. So I'm going to go back home, get some food, probably edit this video, and get to bed because you got to be up. 5 o'clock club tomorrow. We'll see you there tomorrow, 5 o'clock in the morning. Peace.